how to create a custom page template for your Shopify store. Hey everyone and welcome, I hope you're all doing great. In this video, I will show you exactly how to create a your very own custom page template. Now, if you are just getting started or just starting out with your Shopify store and if you go to pages, um, let's say you want to go ahead and actually go ahead and add a page, you should be only or you should only have within the theme template the default page or the contact page template so what if you actually want to go ahead and create your very own uh, theme template this way you can just um, create a page and have it look in a specific way and make just just edit things much easier and faster with shopify using this method because this way you can actually go ahead and create a masterpiece, make it a template, and you can just go ahead and edit. It's much easier for your page. So let's actually go ahead and not waste any more time and uh, show you how to do so. So first, just log into your Shopify uh, admin, go to online store, go to themes, and then basically here you have two methods to do so. Either if you just next to the theme that is already working, Click on the three dots, go to the edit code section, and you should be able to see templates and you can just click on add a new template. And you can just go ahead and select a template type. And this is method one, which I do not prefer. The second method would be just go ahead and click on customize for your theme. And basically here you can just edit everything that you need for your pages and stuff and this is not going to be what we are looking for what we are looking for is if you click on the top uh, of the page for your shopify editor just click on here uh, and then here you should be able to see the types of pages and stuff that you have in here we need to scroll down find pages and click on the arrow next to pages here's going to show you all the templates that you have for pages uh, and we can just basically click on create template and now we need to go ahead and uh, do some sort of research so here uh, I mean not research just editing uh, so give it a name a name that is going to let you know precisely the type of template that you want it to be so we can just do uh, example template for the time being for the sake of this video and next we need to base it on a previous template that we have so we have the default page and the contact page i'm just going to base it off the contact page so expect to have the contact information in there once we start but don't worry you'll be able to change things up later on and then it's going to be this in here okay so basically just give it a name base it off of the previous template that you have and click on create template it shouldn't take too long and it's actually just going to generate it for us and now we go crazy and edit this entire page to our liking uh, this way we can just create our own templates so the first thing that you can do if you don't want to have the contact template to be showing for example we don't really want this in our template we can just go ahead and hide the page section here so you can see we can just hide the page it basically basically just you know you can see the title disappeared so we don't really want to show this and we don't want to also show the contact form so we can just go ahead and actually delete it and now we can actually go ahead and adjust this entire thing for our liking so i'm just going to add some sections here to make it special so the first thing i'm just going to go ahead and add a image banner just so we you know actually get to know the sorry the template better so we can just go ahead and select uh first image let's explore okay so now we have added our uh, image banner here we can just go ahead and exit out i don't really need to add more stuff in here i'm not going to edit this text either next we can just go ahead and add more sections let me just add something else we can add a let me see. Let me just add a future collection. That's it. 
So we have our future collection and a banner image. And once you're happy with the template, so basically you can just use this template and edit things like the name of the image banner and the actual collection. Click on save. And now we should be able to have this template uh, saved um, for us. So now if you actually want to go ahead and create another template, you will be able to actually base it off of this one. If you click on create template, for example, you can see now it's actually a part of the template list that we have. Now, how to go ahead and actually use the template that we have just created is very easy. We can just go back and we don't really need to be in here. We can just exit out of the Shopify editor. Uh, and then from here, we will need to uh, go ahead and navigate to pages. Wait for it to load. So simply what we need to do, or basically now you have a template ready to go. So how to use it is very simple. You just need to go ahead and add a page or create a new page that you want to have the template working on. Uh, why is it not great? Okay, there you go. Add page, give it a name. So let's just name it the template page, just so we can, you know, actually see it. Whether it's visible or not, it's up to you. But no, most importantly is we go ahead and change the theme template to example template. And we can just go ahead and click on save. There you go. And now we can just go ahead and exit out of here. We can just go to our online store and we should be done. This should be uh, over. If we just click on customize, now we have a page that actually uses that template. You know, I could have actually just used, viewed the page from that place, but it doesn't really matter anymore. Uh, we can just go ahead and actually find uh, the page from here. If we just go to pages, we can go to, uh, where is it? Shouldn't be over here. Wait, hold on. Uh, wait. I think you just didn't load in pages. Oh, it is in here. I just didn't see it. So you can see now it's assigned to one page. So we can just go ahead and click on it and you'll be able to just go ahead and see it. It's you, you can just go ahead and edit these things out and you can always just go back and go to pages if you can. And if you want to view the exact page, you can just go always in here, view page. And it's going to be in here with exactly the same template that we have just uh, used and created. So this is pretty much how to create a custom made template or custom page template for your Shopify store is very easy and simple. So I hope you liked this video and thanks for watching.